I jinxed us last episode. I'm 100% sure of it. We were 4-0 with the Bengals Jamar Chase jersey on. And then I switched it up and we got our first loss of the season. We're now 4-1. It was stupid of me. I don't know why I did that. I'm matching Tito. Clear why it would have worked. So let's recoup. Let's have an amazing episode of Wheel of Mutt today. If you need to get caught up to speed, we finally made some offensive line improvements. We got Trey Pipkins. We've got Creed Humphrey Country Strong. But last episode, I did have an amazing left guard and an amazing right guard, but we lost. So I didn't get to keep them. Wide receivers are looking great. My backfield's looking great. I could certainly use a fullback and a backup tight end on offense, but we've got some budget linebackers and then the amazing Anthony Walker Jr. We got Derwin James Prestige. We got Jesse Bates. We got Jalen Johnson. We got Joey Porter. We got Cromartie and Nick Bosa still. I cannot believe it. Nick Bosa still doesn't have a guard. As you're watching this video, we're probably really close to the Harvest promo coming out. It hasn't come out quite yet, but the hope is a Nick Bosa Harvest card. And if he gets a Harvest card, it's going to be a 92 overall. Historically, they always have been. So if Nick Bosa wants to get a little 92, I won't be too mad about it. But for now, we're stuck with the 86 overall. Keep in mind, Nick Bosa is a prestiged player, meaning I'm always entitled to the best version possible. That's why I'm hoping that they drop a 92. One more win and we secure a spot in the playoffs. Two more losses and we get booted. So let's not go on a three-game loss streak. Let's just recover right here and go straight to the playoffs. All right, y'all, let's waste no time. The very first wheel spin of today's episode. I kind of want to get my guards back. Let's see if it's possible. 40K per tier on a tackling mini game. So if I get bronze, I get 40,000. Silver's 80,000. Gold is 120,000. We're taking on the Raiders, which means we're taking on Josh Jacobs. All right, I'm going to be the Niners, so I get Fred Warner. All right, we're going chase and tackle. I need 30,000 for gold. I have the world record on this mini game. Fun fact. Like, actually, I did a YouTube short on it. So if you guys have, I don't know if you would have already seen that YouTube short, but I'm pretty good at this one. I finally figured it out. It gets really annoying when the halfback decides to stiff arm the shit out of you or like make the most aggressive cut you've ever seen i'm gonna have gold at like 38 seconds this is gonna be a cake oh this is too easy bro i was in the lab playing this for like literally six oh that resets my multiplier too wait a minute Matt. shut up bro shut up shut up and finish the drill if you're wondering the cut stick is the safe option oh my god like what is that that was trent richardson levels of the cut stick is always the safest to keep. Dude, am I gonna am I not gonna gold this? I was just talking myself up this entire time. Wait a minute. I need 30,000 for gold. Oh my god, I'm not gonna get any multiplier here because holy shit. Holy shit. Holy shit. Holy shit. Okay, I have to I have to be perfect the rest of these tackles, or I'm not gonna get this. Oh, I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna clutch up. I'm gonna clutch up. We need a fumble though. You get so many bonus points for a fumble. I like low. <laughs> oh! Stop! Stop. Oh my god. Oh, can you imagine like a new viewer? Like someone's never seen Wheel em Up before and they just click on and they think I'm the Madden guy and then they just watch that, bro. That was, oh my god, that was pitiful. Guys, my high score on that is 288,000. I just got 20,000. Luckily, it's not the end of the world. So for silver tier, I get 80,000 coins. Landon Dickerson is 73,000. It's an 87 overall left guard. I will survive. All right, boys, first wheel spin. I got one of my guards back. So we got a left guard locked in. We still got two wheel spins left. Let's see what we can get on this one. Ooh, I'm get oh, I'm giving EA money on this one. I get 6,000 Madden cash to spend, and I can keep not one, but two players out of, out of that 6,000 Madden cash. It's actually an insanely good time to get this wheel spin, aka Power Fantasy Pack. Crazy good for Wheel of Mutt. I'm just going to open it. It, it there's, there's a whole bunch of nonsense words over there. This is definitely more than half of our budget, but we get a guaranteed 88 overall player. Now, if one of these is Creed Humphrey, that'll suck. So I already have him. So just not Creed Humphrey. Huh? No. I had to think about that, but no. I think all my corners are better. Jalen Johnson's better. Joey Porter's better. Antonio Cromartie's better. He's washed. He's got he's got 86 speed. He's washed. Ooh, please don't be Creed Humphrey, bro! Yes. Oh, my. That's just diabolical. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. It's not over because I only get to keep two players from the 6,000 Madden cash anyway. We get two 84 plus. Oh, and we get another 88 plus. Okay, we're fine. We're gonna clutch up here. You're not clutching up. You're not clutching up. Dude, this sucks. Well, actually, Drew. Jerome Bettis is a new fullback. So technically we have an option right now. The unfair. Oh, that's a big one. That's a big one. Ah! 
No, no! I can't use you either! Oh, do I sub out? Do I sub out Josh Allen for Johnny fucking football? Dude, this is insane. I feel like, why would I take Josh Allen out? Because Josh Allen's playing so well. But like, dude, Johnny football? Josh Allen is better. This is so unbelievably painful. 88 plus! Come on, baby! I need you to clutch up! Dude, any fucking position other than the ones you're giving me. You're sucking mud! There's a new limited Russell Wilson. That would have been a quarterback upgrade. There's a 91 strong safety, CJ Gardner-Johnson. There's a 91 Kenneth Walker. Walker. There's a 90 Justin Jefferson. There's a 90. I'm doing this 2x pro playmaker packs. I have 2,100 Madden cash left over. So this is 800 of that. This will leave me with 1,300 Madden cash. Technically, I could get everything that I need to keep in these packs right here. 85 Ronnie Lott. You low, like a low key, I could take something like this just to prestige him down the line. But I probably won't. Matekovic. Okay, Mafe. No, thank you. Kind of want a backup tight end, bro. Creed Humphrey, guys. It's just, it's just insult to injury. They're just fucking with it. Andrew Norwell could low-key go at right guard. I have enough for a Triumph Elite Pack. Felix on a DK uses... No, he doesn't help me. And choke. Linderbaum is a plus 11 at right guard. He's a 79 overall right guard. That is a big upgrade. And then obviously Jerome Bettis is going to be a lot better than a 68 here, I'd imagine. Yeah, he's a 76. So that's a plus 8 at fullback. Like it is. He's obviously pretty big upgrades, but just not. <laughs> that's... Bro! Third wheel spin! You have to save me. Trash packs, horrendous tackling. You gotta save me. Yes! Yes! I'm saved. Legends jackpot, so I could get any legend in the game. Tell me why I want this 90 overall Luke Keekly so much. If we took this Luke Keekly, do we move Anthony Walker to an outside linebacker? They technically could both be middle linebackers on certain formations, but not all of them. I don't want to run like a nickel and then pull them both. It's honestly a really tough decision. So Aikman's out of the question. I'm not taking him. Mean Joe Green, technically I could do that because I'm missing a D tackle too right now. I think Mean Joe Green's a really good option too, but I'm going to go with the 90 overall. He also gets Lurk Artist. I know for a fact. And you know why I really want to do this Luke Keekly? When I lost last game, that guy had both Luke Keekly and Patrick. Willis Lurk Artist. It was scary. It's also going to be fun to try out a new user. So I'm actually going to make Luke Keekly the primary. He's virtually the same thing as Anthony Walker. He's two inches taller, one speed faster, less excel, better block shedding, hit power, and zone coverage. For now, I'll put Anthony Walker at MLB2, but I'll make sure I sub him in so that if it's nickel and there's only three linebackers out there, that Anthony Walker is also definitely. Dude, look at this linebacker duo. Everything looks good. Linderbaum's at right guard. We've got a new fullback in right guard, technically, even though they're out of position. We got Landon Dickerson at left guard and a 90 overall Luke Keekly. The challenge wheel. Don't ever sleep on the challenge wheel. The challenge wheel is the sole reason that we kept Creed Humphrey last episode. Our challenge. This one looks a little confusing. Let me explain. 10 plus yards per reception with a minimum of four receptions. So one of my receivers has to average more than 10 yards per catch. It's really not that hard, but it stops you from throwing short passes to the same receiver. God. 92 Nitro, 92 K9, 91 Lamar. NFL young boy. Let's see if he lives up to his name. I got my two best middle linebackers in. K9's got an ability. I don't know what it is, but I am scared of it. It definitely, like, makes it so he breaks the first act. I don't know what the ability is now, but if I ever... Ooh! What's that K9 ability? Fucking freight train. He's gonna go back to him. Ooh! An end around, but I'm over here with Luke Keekly! And I may not have made that tackle in the tackling drill, but I'll make it in the game. Oh, why are you throwing that? I fucking glued to that. NFL young boy, my ass. So Jamar Chase might catch that. I don't know. Oh, and that's a first two. Night train lane. I was scared he was going to get me there. Hey, he's shading inside. So a Jamar Chase whip route's going to kill him here. I just need a little bit of time in this pocket. Oh, maybe not. Oh, but I had McCaffrey. Yoshevis. Big post route. <gasps> I was almost caught by McCaffrey. That's exactly what we needed! Oh, and we can't kick this? I never bought a really good kicker, so yeah, I can't hit that. Fourth and five. There it is! The whip route! Tyreek Hill! Got him! Who's on McCaffrey? Nobody's on McCaffrey! Insane catch! Big juke! Too easy! That was an insane catch for McCaffrey. Most running backs would never have caught that and continued to run. But McCaffrey's one of the few running backs that has really good receiving stats. That catch, and then look, he put his left hand on the ground to keep himself up. That was a very cool animation. He's gonna pass, play action. Got this bottled! 
Oh, and it says timeout on the screen. Is that supposed to be a penalty? It is. Intentional grounding. And he wants a slant right here, but I got this box up. How is there no pressure? <gasps> Dude, Derwin's slapping that thing like, like he's beating his wife. Just intercept it. I didn't mean it like that. I meant it like if I was beating my wife. Ah, okay, I'm gonna shut up. There's no way what I just said ever comes out well. Get home! The Cowboys are boxed! No way we get a rage quit against this team, bro. First and 10. Let's see what he wants here. Ooh, who is that guarding McCaffrey? That zone. He just switched his own. Oh, he was in man, and he just switched his own. All right, this is good. Jamar is looking on pace right now. I could throw a short one to Jamar. I can afford it. Whip, 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 whip. Ah, okay, don't clip that out of context, though. Don't clip that out of context. I know what that looked like. It was just a good whip. We're putting a good whipping on this guy. Okay, I'm done. I'm sorry, I'm done. You know what's crazy, bro? He got like seven, eight yards on his first run with Kenneth Walker. Hasn't gone back to him since. I mean, he threw it to him there, but hand the ball off, bro. End around. He believes in this play. Ooh. Way to read your blocks. Nice play. He wants the dig. He wants the dig. He wants the dig. He's not getting anything. Oh, uh, he can hit 80. Oh, nice play. First and 10. I'm guessing pass, though. I really hope he doesn't run it. Yeah, he doesn't. He's lucky that that was such a dog shit ball. That's end around. He really wants that to work. Hell yeah. That's the Luke Keekley Anthony Walker duo. Checks down to K9. Anthony Walker is all over it. I'm serious. That is a deep QB sneak. Oh, it's not a QB sneak. He's down many plays. Antonio Cromarty tackles Derrick Henry. Oh my God. That was a mutt. Dude, his Zach Martin got in the way. Let's secure our challenge. Play action. Hang out in the pocket. Deliver. That's his fourth reception. Let's go look. Let's go look. I, I don't know if he has it. I didn't get a lot of yards on that. Oh, he already had it. Five receptions, 62 yards. That means he's averaging 12 yards per reception. I'm saying all these words. That was not bad. Right now, it's a two-position lead. If we can hammer home a field goal before half, this game is over, over. There's Gronk again. I'm telling you, man, this play was was built to fuck over man coverage. QB spy? No. Go, 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 go. Yes, hippie. What a ball! Out of bounds, Yoshi! I think he got hit stuck out of bounds. He may have CTE, but we'll get a field goal out of it, and that's all that matters in the league. Luke Keekly is in at tight end. I don't know how that happened, but I don't ask those questions. I just throw lasers to the open... Ah! Oh, that could have been a touchdown if I had waited another half second. Okay, this is such a horrible position to be in. You're telling me McPherson can't hit this. Like, seriously, he can't hit a 55? Let's go. We got to do this so fast. One, two, buckle my fucking shoe. You're not out of bounds. I can't McPherson hit from 55. Do we throw to Keekly? Do we throw to fucking Luke Keekly? <laughs> he catches that shit. <laughs> he's pissed. Oh, you know he's pissed about that. That's a blitz. Oh, look at you, buddy. So open that I could throw a 360 pass off my back foot. Can we talk about Josh Allen's stat line right now? Bronk up the middle. Tyree kills my backup plan. And CMC wheel route is fucking home free. Double safety blitz. Come on! Oh my god, I'm reading you like a book. Wait for it. Double safety blitz. Bingo. That's what he ran last time when I should have had a touchdown. No way, is this going to work? No, it's not worth it. Definitely could have thrown that to X. Might get it. I'm going to take the field goal. One that Evan McPherson can hit. I believe in you, buddy. He drills it. Can't get to it. Nice catch. Good hit, too, though. I'm happy about the hit. Christian 10. He's in no huddle. He wants it. Little boot rollout. He's going to throw it in no man's land. What are we doing, man? This ain't Madden 20, bro. There's no dashing dead eye. That might be the rage quit. It's it's ironically been all defense. This game is so offensive, so it's crazy to have. It's crazy to have a shutout. I'm quite proud of myself. Oh. I was about to say, bro, throwing the ball can only harm my stats. Ooh, didn't get home. Can I take the angle? Don't pull him in. Jalen Johnson gets cooked there by Diggs. Good ball, Lamar. Ah, uh, is he go for two? Yeah, he should go for two here. Yep. Oh, I own you. Ooh, I sniffed that out. See what this looks like. Onside kicks are really good, bro. They got, they buffed the hell out of onside kicks. You can really return these. See what he's got. He's even got limited butt curve. Somebody actually refund this guy. Yoshi. 
Not only does Yoshi catch it, but he takes it into enemy territory. And now if I get a field goal, it's a 15-point game. Yeah. He's pressing up, and he's moving his user, which is amazing, because I'm going to be... Free. Ooh. Right back to cross drag. Oh, is that out of bounds? Oh, wow. What a run. Third and nine. Stretch cut up the middle. Could make it a three-possession lead again if we can just soar this. That was too easy. I got no line now, baby. 18-point lead. I'm going to try and extend that to 20 with a stretch run here to McCaffrey. We got the numbers. Oh, no, we don't. Sheesh. I might just run the score up on him now. Zach Koontz. Zach Koontz. Zach Koontz! The silver! Who are you? What are you? Ah. Uh -huh. McCaffrey's having a PPR day. Yeah. His guest pass. He's going to get a touchdown, and I'm so mad about it. He did! Oh my god! Oh my! Oh my god! Wait, this was actually disgusting. I've always thought that like we should have some extra special reward that I do if I ever get a 40 bomb. I was thinking about getting, do you guys know Panini National Treasures? They're like really expensive boxes of sports cards. I was thinking about having like a couple of them just in the background, a couple boxes. And if I get a 40 bomb, I get to like open it, give away the cards, and then I get to keep one player for my team. And he's gonna kneel it out after the 40 bomb. Honestly, respect. 142.9 QBR out of Josh Allen. The only reason he's not perfect is because I threw that one dumb interception. He's being greedy. Also, oh shit, I smoked it. We had the challenge with two people. So Gronk fell short. He had the four receptions, but nine yards per reception. CMC gets it for 13.2. And then Jamar Chase, 7-145. Jamar Chase is going to win MVP. If we make it to the Super Bowl, we're going to do the first ever Wheel of Mud Awards ceremony. Jamar Chase is winning it on offense. I don't know about defense yet, though. Two TFLs for Antonio Cromartie. He did make some huge plays. Wait a second. Dude, I think it might be Bruce Smith right now. Bruce Smith has had a sack every game. And there's an interception for Bates, Joey Porter, Luke Keekley, and Derwin James. So we finished the season five and one. And all that's left, you see it there on your screen, baby. Survive the playoffs. So the playoffs in Madden 24 are a wild card slash divisional game. Then it's the NFC Championship slash AFC Championship. And then it's the Super Bowl. I guess it's the, we're the Bengals. It's the AFC Championship. I did complete my challenge, so I could get one of any pack in the store. EA's got a coin shuffle. Just straight up gambling degeneracy. I'm gonna go with an all Madden pack. I technically could pull the 91s. We're guaranteed two of the 82s or better. 82 John Runyon. He might be better at right guard. Probably not. David Mayo, left outside linebacker. We got 82 Marvin Harrison. No, he's not anywhere. Kayvon Thibodeau. Kayvon Thibodeau. He's got a 90 overall most feared. And it's, what is he, top five or top 10 in the league in sacks? He's having a good season. I'm gonna make sure I go throw Kayvon Thibodeau in as a backup on my defense. In case I make this Super Bowl, bro. I think Kayvon Thibodeau has a chance to be a really good prestige player. All right, y'all. Hell of an episode. Seriously. That worked out super well for us. We head to the playoffs, so the very next episode that you guys see will be in the playoffs. I love you guys. Thanks for watching, as always. I'll see you in the next Wheel of Mutt. Peace.